<laughs> what up, internet? Alright, right now, I decided to make a video because there's nothing better to do. Uh, I am painting mushrooms. See? These are my mushrooms. I went to Michael's and I bought a bunch of mushrooms and I'm painting them. I'm gonna put them in the garden. It all started back in, like, Mother's Day when I'm, you know, a wonderful artistic little daughter and I made my mom a mushroom. And I painted it and she put it in the garden and it was really pretty. And then she's like, oh, Megan, go buy more. Uh, I want to put them in my garden. And she's like, I'm like, okay, why not? And so the first one's in her garden. This is the second one I ever made. Isn't it pretty? Yeah, I know. And now I'm making these two. This one's a fade. This one's going to be gold. So I'm just going to paint while I'm making a video. Whatever. I'm using acrylics. They're not, it's not like outdoor paint, but acrylic's acrylic, and acrylic will stick to anything. So I'm going to use it. This is my palette, isn't it pretty? <laughs> Look at the mess. It's like just layers and layers of old, nasty tempera and acrylic and crap on clear plastic. It's a lid of just like cookies or something, I don't know. But... So, yeah, I'm just gonna talk to you guys while I paint. I <laughs> took my dad's spool of, like, string or thread that he uses to fix the boat with, and I put my mushroom in it, so it's sturdy. <laughs> it like fits in the ground and stuff, and I just I don't want to hold it because it's a mess. But yeah, coating it with gold. I forgot what I was gonna say. The gold is really pretty, and it actually looks gold. Like you know, you get a gold marker or whatever, and it's not really gold. It's just dumb yellow, and it's dull. But this actually comes out as shiny. And really pretty. Yeah. So, that's what I'm doing. I'm just painting mushrooms. Like a boss. And I debated selling them. Like, making them and selling them at shows or online. And then I'm like, they're on clearance at Michael's and there's like three left. So, there goes me selling them. So, yeah. This is always fun. This is my art station. I know it's very glamorous. Here, let me pick y'all up so I can show it to you. Okay. This is it behind me. It says Megan on it. It's... That's my light. <laughs> Some other crap I made is there. I made that mask. You know, I got my skim board at the top. I got all my feathers and my art stuff and, you know, whatever. And as you can see, I'm not inside my house. I'm in my effing garage. And it's summer and it's hot. I had my fan on, but I didn't. I turned it off for the video, so you wouldn't hear my fan whirring in the background. Yeah. And also, I have actually okay lighting for once. No Google Desktop. I don't want to agree right now. For the love of Jesus. Pop-ups while making a video. What the f? I'm trying to be internet famous here. Whatever. So yeah. Painting mushrooms. I'm gonna add white dots to them if I can find a small enough brush. This will work. I, I am really bored. I would have my iPod in here, plugged into speakers or something, and jamming to it, except for that it died while I was browsing the fail blog. <laughs> So, I have my laptop in here while making a video that no one's going to watch. Whatever. That's how I do, I guess. Doesn't the dots make it look cuter and more poisonous? My mom said that the last one I made, this one, this one, uh, looks just like mushrooms from Poland that they would eat minus the white dots. So, that's cool. Who knew? So as you can see, I'm really running out of ideas for videos. I made this whole new YouTube channel. And I just... Don't know. Ran out of ideas. Don't my computer falling asleep. Ran out of ideas completely. Already. Like, my last video was about how to fake that you're an artist. And I don't know if I conveyed the message. It was, you're supposed to draw crap that people can relate to. Like, draw stuff from their childhood or something popular at the time or... 
just, you know, something that people can be like, oh, I like that. I can relate to that. Even if it's a crappy doodle of, like, Bugs Bunny, you'll be like, oh my god, that's Bugs Bunny! Because I remember, like, when I was a freshman in high school, I had no artistic talent whatsoever. Legit, you can quote me on it. And I was, like, sitting at lunch. It's effing hot in here. I was sitting at lunch, and I was drawing, like, something, and this girl came up to me, and she's like, oh my god, you're such a good artist. Draw Tinkerbell for me. Um, I was not a good artist. Like, I was even faking it back then. I, I thought I was, but now I look back and I'm repulsed by my sketch pads. They don't care if it's bad, they just want to see something that they like. It may not make sense, but try it. Go to someone, like a friend of yours, and if, like my friend Brittany, she's obsessed with horses. If I drew a stick figure horse, she'd be like, oh my god, Megan, it's so cute. <laughs> I love you, Brittany. You're probably going to see this and be like, what the F? I hope I'm not going to get a phone call later. <sighs> Megan... Don't make fun of me in my YouTube video in your YouTube videos. What do you think? I think it's cute. I don't know if I should do more dots. I'll do more dots. I don't know if you guys saw my paintbrush rack. <laughs> I have like 200. And this isn't even all of them. Some of them are in my room because I was body painting. Oh, you can only see the light. <sighs> yeah, whatever. There's brushes there if you can't see them. I can't tell. Maybe a little one. This should work. Oh, never mind. This one will. So yeah. About art. I have been drawing since I could hold a crayon. And I only recently started using it to try to make, I wouldn't say a living, but some little profit on the side. I face paint occasionally at like community events and if I can do I'll do parties and crap and I what do I do oh I go to events and I sell like jewelry and plant garden stuff that I make and right now and I also I do murals and stuff I've only been paid for one I also worked for Plant to Fish I was their illustrator for a while I think I still am and I drew, like, diagrams of crap, which was really fun. I loved it, you know. I'm really into science, so that was cool beans. And then, let's see. Oh, like, I recently started making, um, like, felt iPod, iPhone, i whatever, something, i whatever, um, phone case things out of felt, and they looked like animals. I the first one I made was an owl, and I thought about selling them, and then I got such a reply. I'm making a video, so I'm going to be talking to myself. <laughs> My dad just walked in. And that's what I was doing for a while. I was making iPod cases until the orders got too crazy and I stopped. I know that's not a good idea, but whatever. If you stay in here any longer, you're going to be on YouTube. <laughs> If you stay in here any longer, you're going to be on YouTube. That's cute. Yeah. My dad doesn't like being on the internet. I talked for eight minutes already? Okay, I gotta stop. My bad, guys. I thought it was like three minutes. So, yeah, I'm painting mushrooms because I'm a cool kid. You know, it's Saturday night and I'm so happening that I'm in my garage in the heat with my lamp which is also really really effing hot sweating while painting some really much like these cute little mushrooms for my garden yeah all right bye